Hello everybody, welcome to Video Games Awesome Live. This is an unboxing episode, probably the first one we've ever done. We did one episode where we like showed off that we had gotten a new PS3 and mm -hmm. we just kind of like showed the box. We didn't unbox it. We'd already unboxed it. Uh, but uh, today we got the Vita. Um, this is mainly for Becky. This is so that Becky can be cool and um, play another uh, portable system. She's the portable player. Uh, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is take away this and do a shablam! Wow! Alright, we we'll lose the chat for a bit here, but uh, we want a close up as we uh, as we unbox this. Um, so yeah, let's unbox it. I guess unbox away. The only thing I've done so far is uh, cut the little uh, sticky bits on this. Oh well, now it's ruined. Yeah, the experience is ruined. All right. Eh. We're listening to Starship Amazing because uh, I couldn't find any PlayStation Vita ads on the PlayStation store. I thought there would be some. I didn't really prepare for this Whoa. today. All right, so Ooh. I'm getting things popping out here. You got there. Long live play things. What is this? A little thing. A little like a thing. thing. Another little okay. thing. Protection plan. No okay. thanks. What's this? PS Vita AR play cards. Bring the world. Oh, this is um, kind of like the 3DS, the PS Vita is supposed to have uh, augmented reality. Just, or, or, oh, yeah. really? So, like, you place these things down. Here, I'll show them. Really? So they're, yeah, and then they'll bring reality and, or <laughs> bring vir <laughs> virtual stuff into reality. <laughs> oh, okay, so those are those, and we'll, I guess we'll play with those later on. Um, there's some packaging. Uh, our monitor where we listen to you guys is gone here. I like that there. One. Looks like a creeper, they say. Oh yeah, totally. Um, and then we have the quick start guide, of course. You'd have to be an idiot to use one of these. There you go. Who uses but quick start guides? Know where and, in French. and in French. Parlez-vous. Avec plaisir. <laughs> Welcome to the world of PlayStation, it says. Bienvenue dans le monde de PlayStation. And, alright, let's see. Charging bits, that thing. Mm -hmm. You put a thing Are into it, in? and Another you plug thing? it in. Not as, um, it doesn't come with a little docking station like Aww, the 3DS bummer. does, I love that which is really 3DS. cool. Uh, you plug it into the standard thing, and then you got a non-standard, of course. You couldn't have just a USB cable or something to charge it. Nintendo does this, too. You have to have a proprietary cable for charging. Just like Apple and Don't everybody else. Mm -hmm. Their own standard cable that has, yeah, that you're gonna have to buy from them if you lose or if you need another one. What the? Oh, and then it is USB on one Close side right though, in. so at least you can charge it from. At least you can. Oh no! Wait a sec. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I think so. But. Okay. I see. What? Now I was gonna say that it's shaped in such a way that it can't fit into another USB, but it can. Oh. All right, but uh, yeah. Anyway, so that's cool that at least you can charge it from a computer if you're like you're on the road with a laptop or something like that. Uh. Last thing I see in here before the thing itself is, a, you know, the, the gray papers, the stuff that's really boring. There you go, Beck. I, or, like I guess we'll papers. set it up here. I'll just do this. I feel very strange not being able to read the chat. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's down for something. You can get that closer to you if you want. Um, and, uh, okay. I don't know how to place this because it's going to block. I'll just go like that. All right. And now we'll look at the PS Vita. This will be the first time I've held one in my hands. How heavy is it? Yeah, how heavy is it? This feels it's like an big. iPhone distributed over this much. This is huge. Yeah. This is freaking huge. And it makes me think that I might actually be able to play big this. Screen. Huge screen. Can I feel how heavy it is? Yeah. Let Ben feel the weight there. Feel good in your hands? It's mm -hmm. got good girth. Mm. It, uh, I think it feels a little bit heavier than I was expecting. 
Yeah, it's got some weight to it. Yeah. Now let me show them a little bit more here. Um, so there it is. You got all the buttons and doodads and stuff, and uh, um, the so you you hold it like this, and it's got dual analogs. Okay, mm. it Shake feels it. a little weird because you expect to be able to go like this, but then the screen's gonna yeah. be like that. Yeah, I think I, that's the biggest problem is you have to tip your wrists up. Yeah. To see the screen. Yeah. If it's a game that doesn't use the two little dealies too much, I think I'll be a lot happier because I'll just mm -hmm. use it like this. Mm -hmm. But if I have to go like this, it's going to feel like weird. Uncharted. Maybe if I go like, I guess I could rest my pinkies in these little grooves that are yeah, on the dude, bottom. I feel like you couldn't fit that in your pocket. And then... A guy pocket you could. Yeah. Yeah, a guy pocket you could. And a, a purse, a girly purse if you yeah, wanted. Yeah, you could fit in a girly purse. Headphone jack on the bottom. Start select to there. I like the an the analogs feel like yeah, decent they, they real feel analog good. sticks. Yeah. Not like the slidey thing on the 3DS. Nice. Uh, not to disparage the 3DS's little slidey thing, but I just think oh, and this PlayStation's always had the good analogs. This back thing here with the pattern of like triangles, X's, circles, oh, yeah. and squares um, is a touch sensitive. Uh, so there's going to be games where you do oh, stuff on the crazy. back. Like little little movements to like you know tweak things, mm. yeah. Like nipples. Yeah. Um, <laughs> all right, I'm gonna turn it on. Do it. Please tell me it actually comes <laughs> charged. I like don't know. three it three DS came. Oh wait 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 wait. There's a top button. It has to come with some charge though. Come on. Really? Huh? For real? Okay. Oh, oh here there it comes. Is. There it goes. Ooh. PlayStation logo comes up, and then uh -huh. what? Sony, uh -huh. and then nipple pad. <laughs> Shake it, they say. It's so beautiful. <laughs> oh, what is that? Oh wait, the front screen is touch. I didn't know the front screen was touch. Oh wow. Oh. Huh. Oh. I thought just the back was touch. That's interesting. Um, oh, you can't really read that. Alright, saying choose English. I'll choose United States. Oh, it's all touch. This is gonna be weird. Um, Eastern time. No. Yeah, it feels just like a uh, an iPhone, pretty nice, much. Uh, yeah. Nice touch screen. I feel like the scrolling doesn't feel. I'm so used to the, the iPhone scrolling that this feels a little bit weird. Just but different. It's just yeah. different, probably. Um, what day is it today? February. 22nd. February 22nd. so weird that the back is going to be touch. Mm-hmm. It's got little music here. If I can turn up the volume somewhere. Oh, yeah. Can you guys hear that? I hope the, vol the actual speakers go louder than that. Maybe the music is just low. Uh, what time is it? We started late today. We're at about 3.31 now. <clears throat> just got to set this up, guys. This is part Sounds of like Dora. getting a new product. <laughs> so there, I've just, I'm just setting the, the, the crap. You can barely see that. It's very faint on here, too. Sounds funky. Y yes, I do have an a account. Do you want to use it? Uh, y yes. Yeah. Yes, I do. So I'll connect to Wi-Fi here and I'll put in my password. It feels like, I, I actually, the, the touchscreen feels really good. Yeah. Um, it's very responsive. Do you think you have model hands? Do I? They're very pretty. <laughs> uh... Not me. Connecting to my Wi-Fi. System software updates required. Yep. Oh my goodness. Okay. Update the system software and then link your account. Oh, so you have to choose do not use until you're able to later link. What? Select your region of residence. They couldn't um, tell you that, or like, you know, program it for Canada. 
No, we're not a big enough do. country market to warrant sending out a special batch. Do. My date of birth. What? I, I don't want to. <laughs> but I, I just ha entered my fucking. You shouldn't have to do it because you already have it. It won't let me connect with my account yeah, because it requires an update first. But I can't get in to do an update until I make an account. That seems silly. I did it twice and it said you must update first. Okay. It made like a proxy account until I can get it set up. Alright, now it's logging in here. It's saying... Hands. In case you're an idiot, this is how you <laughs> hold it. <laughs> and then things go in it. And then, um... I wanted to talk to me in that voice. Some other shit happens. It's very blue, very pretty. The screen is gorgeous. Yeah, like, look at that. It is. It's a really nice it, screen. The definition blows the 3DS away on this. Like, it's a beautiful HD screen. In fact... It really, really is. It's borderline retina. Yeah. I was wondering. Yeah. Borderline. I can still make out some pixels, but I'll only know until when I see uh, um, text. Uh... Anyways, you guys barely be able to see. It's just playing a video that shows off. Bullshit. Yeah, it really doesn't do it justice on there. It's 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 a very pretty, pretty screen. Looking. It'd be nice if I could have this video up on there. Mm -hmm. And that's actually one thing that I'm um, pretty uh, sad about is that I'm not going to be able to uh, do videos on PS Vita games because the PS uh, the PSP had video out, but the P the, Weird. the Vita doesn't. That they took that away. Yeah. Um, this is the home screen. The home screen is where you start applications. All right. So this is just like... Can, I can scroll around just like an iPhone. It's a, it's another iPhone. Like, this product wouldn't exist yeah. if not for Apple. Yeah. <laughs> Again, like most things, but whatever. That's a good thing, right? Pretty sure the later versions of Vita will have a TV jack in it. So that I guess um, you can start parties on here. You got a PS Store, yeah, which I would love to go into the PS Store with my account and just check out what they have. But this is the live area. Press Start to start it. You head in. The menu system is gorgeous too. I don't know if it's intuitive yet or like if it's going to be annoying to use later, but. Update using Wi-Fi. Yeah, just like I asked you to when we started. Fuck. Vita does not understand. You can put many app... What? Okay, thanks for the hint. Give me the software agreement. Yep. Did you read it? Why won't it read? <laughs> Update. Go ahead. Jesus. 81 seconds. At least it's going pretty fast. Uh, the girl at the store told me there was about 10 minutes worth. 10 minutes worth of updates? Yeah. Well, it depends on her connection. Oh, I guess so, yeah. That's true. Uh, it's black because this is a completely green screen on there. Oh, it's surprising how much green yeah, is showing totally. up. Yeah, totally. Um, I'm going to wait for that. So, what Vita games are you guys excited about? I'm going to try to make the chat room work where it's supposed to right now. You can see some of the chat in the phone. In the yeah. Oh, there you go. <laughs> nice. I can show you guys through. Whoa. It's like a little magic window. Uh, just give me a second. I'll, I'll bring you guys in. We are in the Vita. Have you guys got any questions about it? Um, I'm green with envy. <laughs> they want to know if we got any games with it or anything. Well, to, we bought... Um, uh, here, I'll bring it out. Eh. Well, we bought the stupid... Um, memory card that's proprietary this Oop. tiny look at my th my it's, fingernail next to it it's the size of your fingernail yeah that's cool. um they couldn't Crazy. just use an sd card they had to come up with their own proprietary cards uh and you can't have two profiles on on a ps vita you have to buy two memory cards and your profile attaches to the memory card that's dumb so to swap users you have to always have your little memory card with you which is definitely going to get lost oh, yeah. God, you have to yeah. pop it out and if it gets lost there goes all your fucking and how much was that um, thirty Four bucks 30? for an eight gigabyte yeah. card. Uh, oh, it's starting another update after that. Two minutes left. Um, <laughs> but uh, what does it smell like? Oh, what does it smell like? Kind of like magic cards. Hmm. Um, 
Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Weirdos. Apples. Uh, Apples. So Not here's really. the. I lied. Here's Uncharted. You want to open Uncharted Golden and see what Abyss. a Vita game box looks like inside? Yeah, I do. Want so to yeah, see we picked that. up Golden Abyss. We wanted to just check out how it looked um, or how it played. You know, it'll be cool to see what the thing's really capable because yeah, that's going to push its limits, I'm right? Um, but you know, more I'm more excited to play the little weird quirky games that come on yeah, on yeah, yeah. Uh, Vitas Me and too. the PSP. I always kind of wanted to get, and I think I might get one. You or well, I could just get no, one. They're like one? fifty bucks now. Um, I might pick one up just to play all the old indie games that were like downloadable titles. Like, there's a lot of pixel-based retro titles. There's a lot of RPGs and stuff. Um, little things. So, oh, wow, it's so cute. You're so little. Oh, little so tiny cute. game. It's even smaller than DS games. Yeah, like, it's yeah. the size of an SD card. This is an SD card size. Uh, here. Weird. That is tiny. How do I take it out? Eh. This is the size of a game. That's crazy. Yeah, man. And uh, so there's the box. Good solid boxes like uh, PlayStation is prone to do is make really solid um, cases, which I like. Unlike uh, Xbox, which I feel like is the cheapest in the industry Those when are it comes get to lost cases. It's sure. just a widow game. Uh, no manual? No manual, no. Um, but uh, anyways, uh, is interesting weird? thing is that most of the games released uh, on release day for the Vita... Um, our, here, I can just pop us back out and I'll bring the chat back in normally. There, and I'll bring in, we can actually scroll through the games up there. Uh, where'd my, the stuff that's available is like, um, all downloadable pretty much, except for Uncharted. Is like the only one that's not downloadable mm -hmm. right now. Uh, let's see. Are we going to get Mod Nation Racers? Uh, maybe. You can also get, f uh, Flickr, right on day one, they have Flickr, Netflix. Nice. Um, live tweet, a tweeting app. Uh, they have Little Deviants, which is like kind of a, I think it's like a mini game ish type of thing. Nice. Um, yeah. <laughs> Escape Plan is supposed to be a really good indie title. Yeah, I like uh, the look of it just from. Yeah, what yeah I see. totally. I kind of want to check that out. Um, Hot Shots Golf for 35 bucks. That better be amazing. Wow. I'm sorry, I don't want to play a cartoony golf game for 35 bucks. Mod Nation Racers would probably be really solid. How is Mod Nation Racers worth less than Hot Shots Golf? Um, the pricing is all over the place mm. for the games. Like 15, 35, 26, Weird. 99. Yeah. Uh, whatever this game is for $10. The Vita box is obscuring the chat. What? Oh, well, deal with it. All right, I'll move it over. There you go. There. You're still going to be obscured. But um, Wipeout, a racing type game, mm -hmm. Army Corps of Hell. <laughs> nice. By Square Enix. I have no idea what ha any ben. of these are. Ben 10, that's a, that's a, um, a cartoon, a uh, kid superhero, but it's a racing game. Blaz Blue, that's going to be, that's a uh, fighting game. Dynasty Warriors. Yeah, lots of, quite a few uh, um, launch one? titles. Lumens is, um, now why doesn't it have a price? Is this just a demo or is... Electronic Symphony. It's a, what is this? Lumens free, playable demo, and the game is thirty five ninety nine. Um, Yeah, Lumens is like a block-based uh, rhythm game. Oh, music like and like. stuff, but for 35 bucks. Yeah, that's one like yeah. uh, on a portable system. Ninja Gaiden, Plants vs. Zombies on day one for $14.99. Um, I've never played that on any system, and it's really popular. Yeah. And here it's addictive. Rayman Origins. Yeah. For how much? And I'm not sure. 35. Is it like the exact, do you guys know, is it the exact same game as is on the PlayStation, or is it like different? Do they add new levels, or? People really like uh, Wipeout. Do apparently. they? Yeah. Okay. Shinobi. Shinobi. Oh. Lots of launch titles. You gotta hand it to them. That's a shit ton of launch yeah. titles on day one. Touch my Katamari. Touch my Katamari. Yeah, we'll get. Yeah, 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 yeah. And everything's downloadable except for Uncharted. I think. Bizarro, Actually, wait a second. Man. Is Uncharted downloadable? No, I don't think so. Oh, it is. Three point two gigabyte. You can download oh. it. Um. Let's see here. Virtua Tennis. 
add-ons, newest add-ons, Mod Nation Blast Blue, add-ons for games that were released today. Awesome. Holy crap. N new PS Vita demo, so you can just see all the demos here that you can try out. I guess we'll be trying all these out just to see how they go. Um, how's this going? Where'd you go? Turn back on. Touch the screen. Oh, it like uh, slept itself, put itself to sleep after it updated. All right, it's updated now. Maybe I can go into the store and like, what could I bring up? I don't know what to do. Yeah, Katamari is going to be awesome, and Little Big Planet when it comes out if mm -hmm. it isn't out already. Vita, or wake up. <laughs> Well, instead, of, I guess I could just um, pop in a game and just see how it how Uncharted looks. Maybe yes, watch no. the intro and see what it looks like. How do I get this open? <laughs> Sounds like the PS2 Maybe space now. noises. There we go. That looks like it's going to break off. It does, doesn't it? Does it feel like it could break off easily? Yeah. It feels like it's going to get worn down as you take games in and out all the time. I think they're really encouraging that you only download... You get a 64 gigabyte card for like 100 bucks. You pop it in and you never have to do that. Mm. Painful process is what they want. Because here, you just put the card in here. No, wait, that's a... What is that for? USB, Charger. I think? So where is the... The charging is that there, though. So where do you put in the memory card? Right there on the bottom. Oh, I've gotten rid of... Uh, Hit the screen to move it. To, oh, fuck off. Why are you turning it off? <laughs> did I? Oh, what God. did you do? I don't know what I did. <laughs> Thanks for the tips. How do I play a game? There it is. He, char he showed it up. Nathan Drake showed up. Discounted game, or uh, downloadable games are discounted too. Oh, I got to insert a memory card to play. Discounted games are what? Don't snap it in half. Yeah, really? Yeah. Uh, downloaded games are discounted apparently. By how much? Uh, Th that's I agree with that strategy because I've always thought that it's stupid that um, games were the exact same price. When you're taking away the cost of distribution and mm -hmm. yeah, and they're 10 selling they're ten percent. It should be more than that because you know when you think about it, the the third when they sell to a third party like Best Buy, do you think they're selling it to them for ten percent off? No, they're selling it to them for like you know half the price or less just to move the product for them yeah so they should be selling it for like you know oh you know why though they don't want to undercut them if they do then they'll get mad yeah they'll say why are we even buying these games yeah. from you to sell if you guys are just going to undercut us like that and that's why retail i can't wait for the whole thing to be changed <sighs> yes restarting so the um, the downside to things going downloadable, though, is uh, it destroys the used market. Hmm. Yes. Because you can't sell one of these things. Yeah. All right, here we go. It's uh, booting into Uncharted. We're not going to show you because you guys won't be able to really get a what's going on. Um, yeah, I like physical copies, too. Yeah. Like, I like physical It feels good. It feels like you like own it, right? Games. Yeah. Okay, it's booting into Uncharted. We're just going to give you our reactions to the graphics. You won't see them, but you'll hear You'll us, see our reactions. Us. And maybe you guys can suggest right wow. now any cool things we can do with it um, that we might want to do before we uh, move on today. Dude, look at that. That's actually really nice. It's a gorgeous... That's not the graphics, though. That's just a picture while you wait for it to load. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Yeah, we put in. There's the first look at the graphics is the spinning little, um, like any Uncharted game, mm -hmm. you got a little artifact in the bottom right being rendered on the fly. Game manual. There you go. There's your game manual, Becky. It was in the bottom left. You click it. Mm. Sony Entertainment presents. The screen is gorgeous. I, I can't say that enough. Like, it's way better looking than the 3DS. But you're, you're buying the two systems for different things. Mm -hmm. Okay. New game. Touch start. Yes. Normal difficulty. Is this volume at max? Uh, yeah. 
Mm. Yeah, it could be a lot louder. For a system this big, like the iPhone blows it away in terms of volume. Yeah. Um, yeah, use the save data. Will it blend? <laughs> now show Will us some amazing away. ass intro. Smexy music. You guys can hear that? Yeah, oh yes, this it. theme. Fuck yeah. I'm a little bit I'm a little bit excited to play yeah, I am too. an uncharted game. It just makes me sad that I'm not I, we can't play it on the show. You'll have to ask me if you can borrow it. It starts with another quote from uh yeah, I bet. Mm -hmm. Huh. Um it starts with another quote from an explorer. This isn't three D. Wow. Yeah, dude, that's rendered on the fly. Like, you can tell it's not as polished as the PS3, but that's still, like... It's really good. It's way better than PS2 graphics. Oh, yeah. Way better. Yeah, kicks the shit out of PS2. Just just not quite mm. PS3. It's like, PS3, if, um... Here, let's see. Tap to open his journal, icon bar. Okay. Can I get right into it? Oh, it wants me to do it. But, okay. All right, I'm moving around now. I'd say it's it's like a... Uh, it kind of feels like some um, PlayStation games, actually. Mm -hmm. You can jump with that. Use these to run and jump or tap the ledge. Oh, yeah, we saw this. Um, look for ledges and then... Okay. What? <laughs> yeah, all right. I get it. Mm -hmm. All right. Can I go? Circle. Triangle. <laughs> it's making me look at this tutorial. Oh, is there one of those things on the side? Hey. Okay. Um, it feels like a, a less complicated graphic PS3 game. You know, one that doesn't push itself as hard. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't look like Uncharted. Mm -hmm. Like, um, in terms Uncharted of polish. Uncharted was just stunning. Like, goes all so. out. So... So you can tap these things to jump up on them instead of... Do you think you would do that? Fuck that. When you're playing? <laughs> no. Yeah. That's stupid. It's really I'll play. awkward. I'll play the way it's meant to be played. But this is... Yeah, this doesn't feel like I'm making any compromises, really, by playing on a portable system. Would they be able to see it if you turn it around? They want to try to see. It looks give, really give it a good. shot. Oh, fuck. It did another tutorial. You lean o out over a gap by tilting. Huh. That I might, yeah. if there's no other option. Yeah, it's really hard to show you guys yeah. what's going on. It especially, looks really good. Especially since um, the screen looks bluish tinge because our lights are, are tungsten and this is... Uh, there, he's leaning when you do that. To be by the hmm. 250 one or the $300 one? The 250 one? Why is there one for 300 I don't know. Is it bundled? I think there's a bundle for 300 Oh. So anyways, I guess that gives us the, our impression of the so graphics, right? So if you can right? stream it with the PS3. What? <gasps> I forgot about that! How do you do that? <laughs> Isn't that... 3G, no. Wi-Fi... Guys! It comes with 3G. Oh no, yeah, we got the Wi-Fi. We don't need 3G. Do it! Guys, yes. is that true though? I thought that it was that P P PS3 games can stream onto its screen. How do I send it up to the to the TV? How do I link it with my... We could try to do that. <laughs> Fraser's face. I didn't even think of that. Great, you blew his mind. <laughs> How do I do it? Somebody help me, somebody Google this shit. Well, <laughs> we have a manual. Uh, <laughs> yeah, look through the manual, Becky. Okay. <laughs> 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 the, oh wait, somebody said the TV stream only works. TV stream only works. Yeah, not the other way around. PS3, PS3 to, to Vita. Vita, not the other way around. I had a feeling. Mm. So I can play PS3 games on the Vita? Why wouldn't we just play it on PS3? Remote play. Is it remote play that it's start 
dick move, Sony. Remote play is a feature that allows you to play your PS3 system from a remote location using the PS Vita system. You must first register your PS Vita system with PS3 system. On your PS3 system, go to settings, remote play, settings, register device. Well, let's see it anyways. Can I'm you gonna... play any game? I guess? That's that pretty epic. crazy. Yeah, like the Wii U almost, I think. And it's just, you just go online and you connect to your PlayStation as long as it's on. From anywhere. Like what kind of a good... Can you uh, turn your PlayStation bandwidth? on from your Vita if it's I off? guess so, yeah. I would assume so. You shouldn't have to remote play settings, register device, PS Vita. That's a lot of seconds. Start remote play and enter the following number. Uh, is it okay that they can see that? Go, hurry, say it. 1843-8391. It's going to be out there for 278 seconds. Once though. it's registered, it's fine. There's no way they would get into their Vita on time to do that. <laughs> Registration com complete. Connect to the internet. You'd have to be a real asshole to do that. Choose how <laughs> that you want to connect to remote play. Connect via private or via the internet. Pr What's pri private? Private network, I guess. Okay. It's connecting. It has this little line going between them. It has like two graphics and there's like a little electricity line going zzz, zzz, zzz. Could you imagine if I would have been able to play it on the TV, the PS? Mm. If it can go one yeah, way, why not yeah. go the other? It seems pretty silly. Pretty silly. That would have solved all my problems. I knew, I had a feeling that I hadn't missed, it, missed that. Because I kept on like Googling like any way to, you know, any cables. So right now, are you on your profile? You're not, right? Because... I did, oh. I don't know how that works. I don't think it matters. Could not connect to it. Check that you have selected network remote play. Network settings, remote play. No. Mm. How do you get to it? Remote play settings. Remote oh, yeah. start, you can put it on, that's cool. Derp trying to use touch screen while playing on your game on the TV might be difficult. There's probably always options Why? to not touch touch screen on the TV. No, that, you still have it in your hands. You play it on the TV while going uh, like this. Yeah, true. That's what I want. Um, custom connection settings. It's a network menu. Not network settings, but network. Network main menu. Like go to the side. There is no network. Oh. Oh, remote play. Remote play. Oh. Mm. So it doesn't want somebody to be able to hijack. Like if somebody's playing or something oh, and then... You... yeah. Okay. <gasps> Sucks having siblings. Okay, so leave that up. Where'd you go? Why do you do this to me? Do I have to press the home button or... Give it time. <laughs> Private network, okay. So it's trying again. There it goes. You must use the PS Vita's system buttons during remote play. So now I'm controlling it. So you guys can't see it now. So this is like the exact opposite of what I wanted. But I'm controlling... Let's see. Let's just play uh, Zora's Wrath on this. Yeah, we could do this today. Here, I'll go into darkness. I have darkness. Content cannot be used Saw during your email, remote Fraser. play. Guys, I can't play darkness too. So what's the point of this? What can I can I play? If I can't play a video, uh, like it says, this content cannot be used during remote play. What's the point of this? Yeah. Um, um, can I watch, can I play the Grand Theft Auto demo? Cannot play that. Not all games. Which games? Are supported. Some support remote play, apparently. Some Who don't. Who knows what do. Let's see if I can play Shank 2. Can't play it. What's the point of this? 
<clears throat> Can I play the Plant vs. Zombies? Selected PS3 titles. Which ones? <laughs> Just Puyus. Just <laughs> say specifically if they are remote play. Could you imagine if Puyus worked? They say it on the box usually. None of these work. Nothing's working. Well, what the hell? Well, maybe now that it's out, they'll start making games that do. Yeah. Only one game has this feature right now. Which one? Booyahs! <laughs> <Who use? laughs> <laughs> it's neat that I'm doing this. Oh, someone you know. gave a link of ones that work. This is neat. Yeah, it's pretty badass. But I'd man, love it if you could play games. Could you imagine if I could stream this to that mm -hmm. with games on the Vita? Then we'd have a whole new library of games that we could play on the oh, show. Someone yeah. said Killzone. I do have Killzone, but fuck it. There's a. I feel like a, it, such a slight lag, just yeah. a very slight lag, enough that if you were playing like a game like Killzone, like an FPS, I don't think you'd like it. Like some games would be fine, I feel, but I feel like some. It's like I would say a quarter of a second, but that's the world in an in an FPS. Sing Star, Lego, Batman, Liar. Something blue, olds blue. Anyways. Interesting. It actually has. Uh, it came with full charge. Yeah, it did. That's uh, cool. Which is nice. Yeah. How long does it last? Um, I, I don't wonder. know. What's the expected battery life, folks? <clears throat> Let's see here. It's got maps. Layer, okay. not liar. <laughs> Oops. Switching between programs is way faster than the 3DS. Feels yeah. like it takes forever to get in and out of stuff. It does kind of feel like it. 22, 22 oh, three to, three to four hours. hours. Three to five hours. It depends on what you're doing. Yeah. yeah. 22, so obviously 22 hours if um, idling, maybe. Wait, that seems really no. low, actually. Four, four hours, hours of basically. gameplay. Yeah. All right, I'm loading up Google Maps, see how it looks on this. It was nice out a second ago. Yeah, it's raining now. Yeah. It's raining. Hard. Here we go, Google Maps. Uh, let's zoom in on our location. Doesn't know where we are. It doesn't zoom you in. 22 it just hours shows. on standby? That seems low for standby. Yeah. Kind of slow for being on Wi-Fi loading this stuff up. Not nearly as fast as the iPhone. Like, if it's on Wi-Fi, it should be... Like, come on, man. Insanely slow, actually. <laughs> What's it doing? The battery can't be changed in it? possible wow. that it, I don't know, I, I might have to tweak Wi-Fi or something. I don't know why. Every one of my devices works on our Wi-Fi fine. All right, anyways, the internet seems a little sketchy to me. Um, it's weird because it's fine on the stream. Yeah. All right, we'll see what else they have here. Uh, the battery can be changed, but you have to send it into Sony. <laughs> Ooh. Mm. If you love the iPhone so much, why don't you marry it? Yeah, Fraser. Why don't you marry the iPhone? Everything has to be judged upon the, the iPhone as a, as a standard. Because they're all copying the iPhone, so why shouldn't they be? Um, I just wanted to find the AR, like, virtual reality stuff that it comes with. Is it, where is that? Videos, music? Looks like you can go side to side, too. It's yeah. Arrow. That's just oh. to go back to your app that you have open. Mm. Mm. So it's got all those open. I guess, yeah. No, it closed down Uncharted. It just knows that it's there. Mm. Um, trophies, browser. It does have a web browser. Uh, PS Store group messaging. Photos. Is near? What's near? Finding out who's near you. They want size comparisons? To what? How about this? 
You know how big a controller is? It's like the size of a controller, almost. Just slightly wider. This is an iPhone. Here, pop it out of the... That's an iPhone. So the, the iPhone kind of fits almost exactly into the visible screen. Yeah, it's almost exactly, like an iPhone is almost the exact size of the actual screen that you can look at. Um, yeah, this finds out who's near you. AR games are downloadable from the PS Store. They're all free, Fraser. Okay, maybe I'll grab one of those then. Okay, that is big. What is big? Oh yeah, it's huge, that, man. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it doesn't, it's not something that I think that you're going to want to replace a phone with if, no. if you don't use your phone to call people. A lot of people don't even, like, use phones to call. So some people this would work if they just want for internet and stuff and listening to music. But, uh, Vita only. Okay, it must be in here. Let's look for the AR games. There is the Street Pass version of Sony. With a couple of insignific insignificant features to it. I see. Vita fireworks, cliff diving. I think these are the AR games. Table soccer. All right. Well, maybe I'll grab table soccer. Snarf, you can't text either. True. Mm. Download that. Yeah, you can't text, that's true. Sign up for the Sony Entertainment Network. What? <laughs> I am! Jesus, fuck! <laughs> Alright, we're not doing this today. I tried to sign in multiple times, assholes. So that's the PS Vita. <laughs> Here, wait. Sony! I don't even know my pet, but I'll try it. It's tits, boobs, tits. Oh yeah, forgot. Why did I ever tell you that? <laughs> it's, I'll tell you, it's really embarrassing when you have to go to an IT guy with that. <laughs> Guys, there's no 3G Vita in Canada? Oh really? really? No carrier um, wanted it, I guess. Or wanted to provide plans lame. or to subsidize it. Yeah. Okay, there we go. We know his password. Great, now they know it too. It's a good thing I know my expiration date and my security code on my credit card. It didn't force me to put it back the, the number back in again, thank God. Fucking Nintendo. You have yeah. to enter a credit card every time you buy something. Yeah, that's lame. Okay, logging in. Yeah, I gotta say, like, it's, um, almost retina. Very, very close. Enough that most people aren't gonna care. Uh, share friends list, share activities, what? Snarf, you can save credit card info in the eShop. You can? Are you sure? I'm, talking, I'm not talking about the 3DS, I'm talking about the Wii. Sorry. I should have been more clear on that. I've... Yeah, I think that... That's true. I don't think I've ever had to enter it again on the 3DS. And hopefully the Wii U will be more like the 3DS in that terms. Okay, so I finally just bought the, three, the free game. It's called Table Soccer, and I think it, it'll, like, use the camera. It's got a camera on the front and on the back, eh? Mm -hmm. Just like on uh, an iPhone, so huh, it's gonna cool. use the. Um, the... Can you do is there video chatting? How good that is. Yeah, I wonder. Can it do video chatting? Anybody know? Does it have like uh, apps already available to do that? To check the progress of the download, press the PS button and then tap the notification. So I press that and then I go up. Took off. Hint. Seventy minutes left in the download. Wow. <laughs> For an 183 megabyte game, it must be having trouble with the with that's the Wi-Fi. Insane. Because that's insanely Skype slow. Skype isn't out. But Skype will be out. 
I don't know. It's a, it's it's neat. It's a very capable machine. It seems like much more capable than the 3DS, and that's what you know. These are geared towards adults. Like they're gonna want all those little bells and whistles. It feels amazing. I'm definitely more more. Um, hey, you know what? What? So I could like log on and check my email and stuff with it, right? Probably, yeah. So I actually would use that because I don't have a cell phone. Yeah, but you just take the phone every time you go. But sometimes Not a big you deal. want it. Okay. No, you can't. No 3G. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. That's um, stupid. That sucks. <laughs> well, we wouldn't buy another again. plan anyways. What? Yeah, I guess. I'll it again. So anyways, it's the size that like I'm, I'm probably going to actually consider playing it sometimes. Unlike the 3DS where I just, I can't do it. Can't do it with my man hands. They call my me an old lady. Cripply old man hands. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so what do you want us to play today? Uh, what do you want us to play first? Did I get an option? I've been hearing a lot of Azura's Wrath first. All right, sounds like Azura's Wrath then. I'll pop this Who out use? on the... Azura? All right, we'll play Azura's Wrath today. And then if we have time, we'll play Darkness. Uh, that went a little bit longer, that unboxing, than I thought it would. Um... They think that you might get angry. But I just wanted to fuck around on the air with it. I might get angry. We'll it's see. fun to fuck around with. Yeah, I, I like touch gadgets. More. I do like the touch touch screen. I feel like for two fifty, you compare this to an iPhone <clears throat> or an iPod. How much is a how much is a iPod Touch nowadays? I don't know. Like they're too pricey, expensive. aren't they? Yeah, it's too expensive. Like, aren't they like three ninety nine or four ninety nine? Well, if it's something that much, stupid? that's stunning. How much are how much is an iPod Touch, guys? I was gonna say like 150. 170, 300, eight gigs for 200, about 300, 200. Oh wow, iPod Touches are cheaper than I thought then. <laughs> so huh. expensive. That's still a lot. Well then, if you're then let's mm. can you get yes. iPod Touches in 3G? Yeah, that's neat. I think so. You can kind of elongate the image whenever you... Yeah, it just does these little jiggle effects. It's neat. Jiggly. 200 for an 8 gigabyte. Okay, so my I was going to make a point that this might be like a bargain compared to an iPod Touch, but it's not. Because <laughs> it does a lot of the things, but... It's hard to argue with the iPod Touch, the library of stuff that's available to you. Like, this has... What does it have? Five apps right now? Mm-hmm. But it also has real games, yeah. you know, like hardcore games, the... too. <laughs> Jiggly. Jiggly physics. I'm like impressed, though. I think, <laughs> I think it looks <laughs> I want, beautiful. I want a little mod that makes all of those boobs. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. A bunch of boobs staring at you in the face every time you play it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that, that game. What's it called? Uh, the one on the iPad? Yeah. Uh, Jiggles yeah, HD great, or something. I don't know. <laughs> um, all right, I'm kind of just uh, lingering on it. It really is beautiful. So mm -hmm. what could we do with people on it? Like, and a water maybe some multiplayer one. games later when they start to come out. Racing yeah. games, maybe Mod Nation. You could play out this Mod Nation along with Mario Kart with people. Yeah. But until people start to get them, we won't worry too much about it. Yeah. Um. Oh, I guess I could have, uh, one last thing. I could check the camera, right? Mm, yeah. Let's see how it looks, the quality of it, looking at us. Chat needs a jiggle effect. Yes, okay. Okay, that, that's horrible quality. Easy living, too. <laughs> um, Flip it. Oops. Okay. Yeah, I can, I can automatically tell that's terrible quality. Start playing Wipeout. That's Compared when you're the MLG. IPhone. How do I switch it to the front mm. camera? Mm. That that uses that gets my location. The other that one. There you go. There we go. Fuzzy pickles. That seems it seems That's like to me. Both cameras are about the Did quality of the front-facing... Yeah, sure. 
Uh, both cameras are about the same quality as the front-facing camera on the iPhone 4. Uh, so, so it doesn't have an HD camera on the back like uh, the iPhone does. But it does seem about the same as the iPhone's camera. I could see maybe doing... I think it might be a little better. Uh-uh. Don't think so? Mm-mm. I make one every day, Ben. How often do you record <laughs> yourself on a video? Mm. I make one every well, day. Not that I showed anybody else. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm. Uh, I could see. Maybe Close I'll get the on the next episode, guys. Next few videos, maybe that I post, I'll do it on do the, it the Vita, so that you guys can get an idea of the quality. Yeah, um, it's a good idea. You know what annoys me though? What? I hold it with my right hand, and if I hold it like this, I have to. Uh, you know, I have to like. The camera is on the right side, so I don't know what to do about it. Mm. I doubt I'm going to use it just because of that, actually. If I could hold it like that, I'd be all about it. Well, even then, I'm kind of annoyed. It's too big, actually. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> to to, to do it, like, the iPhone's so easy. I'm just yeah. like, like, hey, guys, blah, blah, blah. This, I'm like, manhandling it. <laughs> like a man. Mm. Yeah. All right. Anyways. All right. We'll play. I'm gonna play more with it, and maybe we'll do a follow up where I talk about our experiences with it and what we think. But for now, that that was the Vita. Thanks for joining us for our first impressions and unboxing. Very first impressions. Our first hour with the Vita. Uh, stick around for more episodes coming up on the show. Of uh, we're gonna play Azur's Wrath. See you in a while. <laughs>